Hi everyone, I hope you are all safe and well. Today I'm going to share with you some tips as to how to manage our cellulite. As women, we are often troubled by cellulite throughout our lives. According to research, more than 90% of women will have cellulite after puberty, and it happens to women with all ages and different body shapes. The only difference is, is that it can be more noticeable on a certain skin type. While cellulite is not a threat to your physical health, it is often seen as unsightly and undesirable. It can lead to stress and anxiety for some people. To eliminate cellulite, we must first know what cellulite is. In simple terms, Cellulite means a dimpled appearance of a skin that caused by fat cells pushing against our connect body's connective tissue. A development of a cellulite is still unknown, but we know that cellulite tend to gather on the areas of body that are static and don't move that much. For example, our buttocks, back or legs, outer sides, and sometimes the bellies. This area also distributes more fat in women. That's one of the reasons why women tend to have more cellulite than men. It's made worse if you sit down for a long time. Sitting down for a long time causes poor blood circulation and lymphatic drainage. And the fat will just accumulate and stagnate in the troublesome area and make it difficult to treat. There are, however, lots of cellulite treatment in the market, but so far there is no scientific evidence suggests that cellulite can be completely improved and cured. I do think massage and exercise are the best way to deal with cellulite. Massage helps improve circulation, get rid of excess fluid, which makes dimple less noticeable. Exercise, as we know, tones firm muscles and tighten up the skin, helps reducing the appearance of cellulite. So enough talking, let me show you my massage method. I do this massage with my tool because it can go deeper, but you can, of course, use a knuckles to do the performance. And I think I need to stand up for this. I hope you can see me. For example, if you think you have a cellulite here, firstly, you need to warm up the muscles by doing this, or with tool like this. You can do it from up to downwards or low to upwards, but just make sure you're not doing back and forth, back and forth. So let's warm up this area here, six times. And then you can do a circular motion like this, all like this, 12 times. Make sure it's firm so you don't drag the skin. And anti-clockwise, 12 times. And then inch by inch to target the problem, to break down the cells. Supporting hand, working hand. I'll use my knuckles like this. I do it on top of my trousers because it's much easier and you can do whenever, wherever you remember that. Of course, you can do it after shower when you put your body lotions on. That's the best time to do it when your muscles are warm, everything feels soft and you can target the area. You can do this all around your thighs and your buttocks. That's my massage, very simple, but you do need to do it every day. But every day you don't need to do it long, just not more than 30 times scraping, otherwise you damage your skin. So next one I want to show you is my exercise. First exercise is single leg lift. You can hold on the wall or chair or desk. Lift up your legs 90 degree or as high as you can and just like kicking the ball from your ankles to activate all the inner thighs and outer thighs for 36 times. And then you've got to use control motion, extend your ankles, 
extend your heels, I mean, and bring your toes in 36 times. I do this to work on all the leg muscles here, 36 times. It looks simple, but actually it's quite tiring. You need to lift up your muscles, lift up your under bum and straighten your legs and don't drop your legs. And then change your thighs. The second one is side lift. Bend your knees slightly and just lift your leg. Doesn't need to be high because your foot has to be parallel like this to the floor 36 times. And then back lift like this. Belly up, squeeze your bum 36 times. Next one will be doing the bicycle on the floor. 100 times say like this. And then rest for 30 seconds. And you do reverse 100 times. You can do this while you watch TV, talking to friends. Again, doesn't require any space. And then you rest. So these are my exercise and massage routine for you. Of course, you can find so many more exercises that target your buttock and thighs area. The reason why I choose them because you can do that anywhere, by your desk, in the office, waiting for the bus, waiting for the tube, anytime. I hope you find this helpful. And if you ever try the massage or exercise, do let me know how you get on. And thank you for watching. See you next time. Take care.